fan of AA this game. It's it's okay. It's I mean it's good with faceless void. Yeah, it is Damn. We'll put a skill. Yep, there's Sacred Arrow. Here is No Tail, PPD. Chilling touch is skill. The universe is gonna go right for it. There's the slow. Arrow should be on the mark and is. And it'll be Big Daddy No Tail who skill. But in a, in the laning phase, that actually does matter. So they're gonna have that along with oh nice arrow from the high ground on Excalibur in mid. They're gonna leap ahead and Excalibur drops as well. Universe solo experience, and I this I've seen them do this before with Universe, even starting out by himself. Um, out in that off lane and have success. Now PPD has a chance at Excalibur again. There's the OD ulti. Dropping the hammer uphill, and let's see. Do they have an arrow? No, don't have the mana for it. The right clicks are more than enough. Well, you know it. They've gone crazy. Now getting Mason again would be a nice step. There's a stampede deployed. He's got stun. He's got stun. Yep, yep, there's that centaur stun. And the war stun. And Drunken Brawler helping out a bit. Uses the wand charges, and ooh, they Whoa. do get him with one last auto attack. Honey's very low, though. Here's the reaction. Universe going to go right for it. And gets a return kill, and that is not worth it at all for Fnatic. And he's got a Chronosphere going to work on Fly. Arrow, oh, <laughs> just barely missed. There's, they still should get him, and got a very time. I know this is all stuff like, well, go, oh, this is what Bro's supposed to do, but sometimes they don't. Actually, oftentimes they don't. Just doing that as quickly as he did actually does make a difference. <laughs> as Mason gets a kill on the Big Daddy, oh. Allison or Arteezy could be in some trouble chase cross nope. around. Oh, that's really quite smart. Can Fly find him? Uh, oh, there's, <laughs> there's the Astral. And Arteezy, no. I'm from Universe God, right now. Arrow hits Big Daddy. Look at his life pool. Takes out more than half with just the arrow. One on attack, two on attack, three. Universe unstoppable at the 10 minute mark. Yep, he's already got up his Morbid Mask. Yep, check that. He's got up a Mask of Madness. Wow, there's a one target Chain Frost and PPD able to make it outside of Vision. The tower simply goes down, but Mason's right there. Mason does have split if he needs it to fly. Getting a little too greedy. Eyes bigger than his stomach. As he. Bottom lane tower for Fnatic. And they're actually keeping this close. So even though it has felt very dominant, oh, here we go. If they get Excalibur here, this will be a big deal. He actually, <laughs> that's actually hilarious. He actually cleared the creep out, whether intentionally or not. There's going to be a stampede and a doom on the universe in mid. This would be a big kill if they can get it. A ulti, shot, Sentry goes down, and universe is dead skis. There's going to be a Mystic Flare, oh, wow. too. PPD eats a lot of that, but Mason's right there. He doesn't have Split, however, has to blink away. They're trying to kite Trixie out and doing a fairly good job of it. There's a dub, stomping a double edge, and PPD just kind of fed that one. Yeah. Not really sure what what was going on in that instance. Trixie is able to blink. He's, I guess, technically he's been involved in three, but more to the point, get, getting those kills. And actually, there's a Doom nice. on the universe. Good catch. Trixie's there. Stampede used. Arrow's going to land. And the Ice Blast follow Mason wants to pay back. They should be able to get Trixie, and Hani's actually slowed as well. He's actually going to be tossed up using the Storm aspects. They're going to try to chase him down, but Excalibur coming in with all those Meepos. They're going to be very careful, and yeah, they're now on the run. He can just hold it there. Just Yeah, exactly. This is what he's doing. He's just holding the Earth Spirit, the Earth One down. He doesn't want to kill it. Oh, uh, he's not in a bad position. Oh, Perfect. well timed on the Mystic Flare. And Mason locked down, cleaned up. Three for one, the exchange. And more help on the way coming from the south. Zai, he's dead. Yeah, is dead. No question about it. You also have a crit creep on to Hani, so he's hitting quite well himself. Um, oh, hang on. Void with the old in mid. Fly brought down with it, and they got up the Ice Blast onto Excalibur. They pop only the Aegis, though. And Arteezy is right there. Yep, and he should be dropping the old woman. There it is. Okay. Uh-oh. Uh this could be problematic. Yeah, they're going to get killed. Oh, yep. See, this is the thing. You can't, like, blink in Meepos and help yourself out because you're just going to get stunned by them lot out of him. He has to be, really be a force to be reckoned with, and he's actually going to be hacked. There's the Doom as well. So Doom on the universe. They're going to be able to bring him down. No, they actually, no, never mind. They doomed Arteezy, not uh, not the Void. I thought when I didn't see the Chronosphere go off that it uh, was a, a Doom on the Void, but behind that, we can see the Brew eating a lot of damage, and yep, he's going to end up going down most likely. Yep. So Mason. Here we go. Oh, there's going to be a Hex. Excalibur coming in. There's going to be the Void ult actually on the Trixie this time. Excalibur not, not good of an ult. missed by it. And Arteezy eating so much damage. Has to use the ulti. The Aegis is gone. He's going to hang on to it. Now he uses it on Trixie. Trixie finally does end up dropping Nepo back up. And Arteezy likely the target. He's going to actually imprison himself. Mason doesn't have split because he used it earlier. PPD doing what he can. And Arteezy's going to end up dropping. That Chain Frost just doing absolute work. But Excalibur! One last auto attack. Brings him down from side. Are they going to go on? Who are they looking for? It's PPD that's right next to him, and yep, they're going to spot him. 
PPD going to end up dropping. Comes a fight behind that, though, and actually we see Trixie going to work on Zai. Behind that, PPD will be cracked down. Just heard a Chrono Spear that's on the fly. Got Excalibur with it as well. There's Mason to follow it up, and they're going to split. Can they isolate him down? They can. He ends up taking the big biff. And now they're on the charge. They, oh, they caught Trixie as well. Tossing him up with the storm aspect, not quick enough with the follow-up stone or anything else to put his blink on cooldown, but they got the stone nonetheless. And no tell can't stand to fight. There's the OD all she's used immediately by Trixie. Using that sheep as to try to get away. They're going to maybe get four. There's a no! Time block in the middle. Oh, fast. I don't think they know this is going on. They don't. It's gonna drop and go to EG. Scalper's gonna go and get off the net, but it's too little too late. There's gonna be the Mystic Flare, but there's the void ulting. And Arteezy dropping the hammer as well. They came in just a little too late immediately. The Midas, really. Yeah, so. Nope, nope. Oh, Excalibur caught with another Chrono Sphere. There's nothing Excalibur can do about it. Throws off the Earth Vine. Nope, doesn't matter. Ice Blast from PPD was there. There's a Mystic Flare that does a bit of damage. But a little wishful thinking on that, and they're going to get in regardless. Now here comes Hani. Hani has Refresher, and he will go ahead and use it. He That's dooms Arteez, but it doesn't matter. That's game. Meepo has no buyback. Doom already used Refresher. Yep. He already used Doom, even if he had buyback, which he doesn't. Yeah, GG. Well played. Very lost it afterwards. Both teams in the driver's seat in different times. You saw E.